Hey guys, so today I'm going to literally clean out my closet with you guys. I had asked you guys if you guys wanted me to do this video where I sort of go through all of my clothes and see what I still like, what doesn't fit, what does fit, and sort of just like show you my entire closet and also decide like what stuff I'm going to get rid of and everything like that. A couple things before we start. Couldn't find a wig cap, so you know, there might be a little situation going on. We're going to ignore it. Also, probably wasn't a good day to wear a wig, but my hair is an absolute disaster. And also, I know my foundation's too dark. So, now that we got that out of the way, let's get started! So, this is sort of like the back part of my closet. Dun dun dun. So, me and David actually share a closet, but like, not like I have my side and like he has his side, like because a lot of the time we wear like the same shirts and stuff like that and same hoodies and jackets. So, I'm like cleaning it out for like the both of us. So I will for sure be trying some stuff on, not trying other stuff. We'll just, we'll go with it. Okay, so we're gonna start here. So towards the very, very back. So starting out, we have this sweater. It says Burnout. And this one I believe is from UNIF. David really, really likes this one, so I'm gonna keep it. It's pretty big too. And it's really thick, so it's comfortable. This one doesn't really look great on me, more on him, so I'll just put this back. Okay, so now this is like a throwback shirt. This is an extra small from Ann Taylor Law. I used to primarily only wear like just like regular plain like long t-shirts. So I'm gonna see if this still even fits because this is probably from like five years ago. This is old. Okay, so surprisingly this shirt actually does fit although I do think it's like a little tight and since it's like not really my color I don't think I'd really like wear this anymore I'm gonna just donate it but I'm happy to see it still fits I don't feel like a a new extra small would have fit me it has to be like stretched out but like it's nice to know that this one still like does fit <laughs> okay and the next I have this like jacket that I got I think like a year and a half to two years ago. This was right before we moved to Portland because I was like, oh, I'm gonna be needing jackets. It's cold there. And it was always tight on me, especially like on the arms. So I'm gonna see if this fits. I don't even know if it fit me that great back then and I was still smaller. So let's just see. Although I think it like technically fits, like obviously like I can like get it on. Like, well, I guess I could button it. It just like feels like tight like I can't really move that much So I think I'm gonna get rid of this. I know a lot of people wanted me to either like put stuff on Poshmark or something like that and I may the problem is is I don't have a printer So when I want to do that I have to like go print things out if I want to sell them on there So I will see how much stuff I actually want to keep how much I want to donate and if there's anything I like want to sell So stay tuned I just wish it like wasn't so tight, but I'm gonna get rid of both of these. Next item is this really long like cardigan. I really like these in like the winter, so I can just be like a 24-7 blanket. But these aren't really like my style anymore. I'm more of like a hoodie person now. But I do think I actually like this, so I think I'm actually going to keep this one. Okay, and then next this is an a Terra apparel shirt. I think this was like one of the first brands to like ever send me something, but I just don't really like crew necks nowadays. I like them when they have hoods. So I'm gonna put this in the get rid of pile. And then this is old, old. I don't even think it would fit like me or David anymore. Okay, next here is this hoodie. I think I got sent this one as well. This one, since it's white though, it did like, you know, not stay as nice as long. So I am going to put this in the get rid of. And then I have a just like plain turtleneck. I'll try this one on. I went through like a phase where I really like turtlenecks, but I don't even know if I wore this like once, so let me try. Okay, here is this. It totally fits, but I just don't really love it. It's just like not the most like flattering thing <laughs> it's just like it's really flowy but like I don't I just don't like it. I think this is a good donation piece so next is just this jacket which totally fits I think I put it in like the back here because it didn't fit but now it totally does so it will be good to wear this this winter continuing on this man overboard hoodie that is just honestly it's so old I think this is like four years old at this point so I'm gonna get rid of this 
This is the same as the like white turtleneck almost thing, just in tan, so I'm gonna get rid of this one as well. Here we go, this is a size small pink shirt. So I'm gonna try this just because I wanna see. I definitely got too big for this shirt at one point, so it'll be nice to see if it fits again. Yay, so this one actually does fit, and I actually think it fits pretty good. So I'm gonna keep this one. Normally this isn't something that would like be my color, but I do like it's pink, so like, it's fine. This is more of like a thicker long sleeve from Forever 21. I don't really like it. I can just sort of remember I didn't like how it fit, so I'm gonna get rid of this. Next, a, another pink shirt. This one's in a large though. I'm gonna try this one on as well. These sort of shirts used to be like what I would wear every single day in like high school and like middle school since it had to be like plain clothes. I don't know, I just I'm not feeling the like v-neck anymore. I feel like I've worn that to death, so I'm gonna get rid of this one and it's still in like good condition, so it'll be good to donate. So next, I don't even know why I still have this. This was a, I forget what it's called, it's like, like a leotard or something like that, that like snaps at the bottom, except I cut it because it did not fit but I really just wanted like a plain whitish sort of something and this was thick enough that my bra didn't show through unlike like the other just like regular like spaghetti straps so I cut this one and it's cut like really terribly so I think I am just going to toss this one here's what that one was kind of before like it snaps at the bottom sort of creates kind of like an underwear sort of thing going on this is from Fashion Nova and I'm not going to keep this one not because like I just technically don't like it, just like it wasn't that great a quality and it was really see-through and I don't think I'll ever be as small for it to not be like this like see-through on me so I'm gonna get rid of this one as well. Next, this one is from Nikki Lipstick. It says I need more black clothes and I am for sure keeping this one because I love her. So this one is like a black version of this. Even though it's like the same one I said like v-necks are dead, this one's black. I'm gonna keep this one because next month I have got subpoenaed for something which I'll talk about maybe in a different video. And I don't have court clothes. Like, I've never been in court. So like maybe I'll wear this. I don't know. I'll figure it out. This is my boyfriend's old lacrosse jersey which I'm going to keep just because I still feel like, you know, you just have to keep stuff like that. Next is, I don't know, what is this? This is more Nikki lipstick stuff. This like goes off the shoulders. I'm gonna keep this really good for Halloween. One of my boyfriend's sweaters, boyfriend's jacket, boyfriend's van shirt. This one is like one of my old van shirt and I can definitely get rid of this because it's really dingy now. I feel like I have a hard time keeping white clothes, <laughs> but this one just like seems like worn to death, but like not in like the comfortable way, like in the like, get rid of it way. Ooh, this is one of my favorite shirts. Let me put it on. So this is just like a crop, but it has bell sleeves. I love that. I love this one. The only problem is like if I like were to raise my arms, it would like maybe go up a little bit. So this shirt may not be appropriate for like nat might right now, but maybe in like 20 pounds less and maybe everything's a little smaller. We'll see. My only problem is I don't know if you can see it, but the laundry detergent that I was using on this got like spots on my white clothes and they were almost like a really really light blue tinted. Does anyone know any way to get that stuff out because I have no clue and just like even washing it a couple more times it didn't help. But like I feel like if you can just sort of see, I don't know if you can, hopefully you know what I'm talking about. More boyfriend stuff, more boyfriend stuff, um... This is just like an orange shirt from H&M. This was my boyfriend's, but I don't really like it, so I'm gonna get rid of it. Next, this is a shirt from like Fashion Nova. It kinda goes like off the shoulders. I, I don't think I've ever worn it except for a couple videos, but I'm gonna get rid of it just because I don't really love it. Next, I believe this is from Fashion Nova as well. It's just sort of a like little halter. Is that what this top is called right here? I liked it when I put it on, but it's just like, again, like it's just not really like something I see myself wearing. Oh, and then here is one from Fashion Nova. I'm going to keep this one. The only weird thing about this one is it has like a regular sleeve almost, but then a sleeve that you have to like tie together. The only thing I don't like is like in the washer, you can see like all the lint like hung onto it. So I'd need to like pick each little part off if I wanted to wear this again, but I'm going to keep this one because I did like it. This one is from Post Malone. It says thick fit. I'm going to see if this still fits. I ordered this and I was really excited to wear it, but then it was like a little tight and I was sad, but I'm going to 
see if it fits now. It used to be like really tight, like I could barely even like move in it, but now it's like so loose. Look at that, like it's like actually big now. Like I can actually put it into like my normal rotation of shirts, which I'm really happy about. It's so like black shirts with like some text is like my style. I don't really have any other style. This is it. Okay, boyfriend shirt. If this is more of like well, we don't really have like designated sides. I think he puts more of his stuff like back here. Now here is this shirt. This one is from Fashion Nova again, and I really love, you guys know I love buying stuff with like this like sort of velvety feel, so I'm gonna keep this, of course. Next is this sweater from Fashion Nova. Again, it has sort of like this cute crisscross thing in the back and all these like ties. I'm going to keep this one. I like this one. I think I actually gave one of these to one of you back in the day. Let me know if you're the person that has it. Next is this shirt. This one is from Fashion Nova as well and it's just like sort of a distressed sweater. I'm gonna try this on because I think the reason I stopped wearing it is it got like a little tight and also I struggle like I hate wearing a bra and so I struggle with like looking appropriate. <laughs> okay I actually do think I'm gonna keep this one. It fits a lot better but I remember that it goes down a lot more in the back than it used to. I think it used to more hang like here, but now it's covered. At least up until like almost like my leggings line that I normally wear. So, good here. Sweater that's from Nikki Lipstick. I'm going to keep because it's so cute. And then me and my boyfriend, before we moved to Portland, got almost matching like really long like rain jacket, like trench coat sort of thing. And mine never fit great if I, I think I have a picture like maybe here and it just really didn't look that good and it was tight on my arm for sure stuff is always tight like right here in the chest area I have no idea why but I'm gonna try it okay so it actually fits and like this is a lot more than I used to be able to bend them you know when things are like too tight on your arms you can like not really go like that it's like not the most comfortable but I could definitely like wear this if I had to and it more than like closes up now I don't think it did before, but now it does, so I'm good on keeping these. These I don't think like were cheap, so like for sure keeping. Next, I don't know why this is in here. This is just like a cute little backpack that I'm going to keep. This is one of my giant, giant hoodies that I like to wear. I'm going to keep this just because I love my giant hoodies. Here is a sweater I got for my boyfriend last Christmas boyfriend shirt that I think is brand new and he hasn't even worn. I think this one is another Nikki lipstick. Not your boo. Also very season appropriate. Keeping this hoodie. This is a Post Malone hoodie. And I think this one will probably fit me like a normal person opposed to like, you know, like a 3XL like I normally wear. Because I think when we went they only had like larges left. So yay. Boyfriend shirt. Oh, this is... Okay, I don't know if you guys remember from like one of my wish hauls like a while ago. I got this jacket and it's supposed to be like really, really giant. And I think it's probably really giant for sure. This was supposed to be like a really, really, really long like cape almost. But I don't think it's that long. It more like goes, it more goes down to like here on my knee. I'm going to keep this because I know my boyfriend was liking wearing it. So it shall stay. I think this side is not packed like nearly as much. And then I still have pants to go through. <laughs> Next is this dye antwoord hoodie. This one's like giant. Normally I wouldn't keep colors like this, but I mainly wear this one around the house because if I wear it in public, like everyone stares at me and I hate that. Then I just have some boyfriend dress shirts. I'm gonna try to do this side now. Okay. Okay. So as I'm editing, there is literally so much footage. I spent hours doing this. So I'm going to have to break this video up into twos just because one video would just be like a lot of footage. So this was part one and then part two will be coming in the next day or so. But make sure to give this video a like if you do like these types of videos. I'm trying to like branch out. Thank you guys so much for watching and I hopefully see you next time. Bye. Nope, nope. Okay, do you want to do it? Fine. Do not knock the camera. Please don't knock the camera over. Hey babe, call her. She keeps whining. Persephone, come here baby girl. What's up? Okay. These are gonna have to go. Next, my camera setting.